Hi everybody, it's Tim here and welcome back to that Eurovision site, Eurovision with a slice of life. Whew, we are coming to the end of this, I cannot believe it. Um, this is the last video for our Junior Eurovision 2024 reaction video series. And this time we are heading over to Malta. And Malta, of course, will be closing the show this year. And Malta is being represented by Ramirez Siberas. Then again, hopefully I pronounced that right. And Ramirez will be participating in this year's competition with his entry, Stille Chekna. Again, I'm very terrible with pronunciation, so hopefully I've done that correct or close to it. But without further ado, let's get on with the final reaction video for Junior Revision 2024. Alright, very slow, like that piano bit in the start, like the hoo in the beginning. You can literally feel the emotion straight away in the start. You look, you can just see how focused he is, like, just giving us the emotional depth of the song. Oh, the build up. Very heartfelt, very emotional. Oh, we got new things coming in now in the instrumentation. Oh, picking up now. Do 180 straight away. Just very heartfelt. Just giving me, starting to give me shivers actually. Loving that harmonization in the background. Okay, so what do I think of Malta's Junior Vision 2024 entry? Can I just first point out, we finally got a full Maltese entry at Junior Vision. Like, you know, for the past few years, either been English or it's a bit of mix, either Maltese with a bit of English, but this time it's just fully Maltese. So really commend the Maltese delegation in this one because obviously like you know we had MJESC but the fact that you know it was selected and full fully Maltese it's a great way to show the international stage your culture and certainly did that it's very emotional and love how it's very different to what Malta would usually send I know we did have a ballad last year with Yulon, but honestly, like, Malta knows how to do Junior Vision. Like, you know, they've, they've been at it since their return, you know, not very long ago. And they've done a pretty good job with it. And, you know, sometimes they don't get the best of results, but... You know, it gives everyone an opportunity to show something different on a big stage, which is what they're very good at doing. And obviously a big honor for Ramirez because he'll be closing up this year's show, performing 17th. And, you know, I'm just curious to see how the staging would be. Would we have some elements of the music video um, being incorporated in the staging? Well, we'll just have to see until November 16th. But that's my thoughts on Malta's entry for Junior Vision. What do you guys think? Let us know in the comments. And if you watch this video and you like what you saw, then please give us a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and push the notification bell to be one of the first people to find out when we have a new video. Also, don't forget to follow that Eurovision site at that year's site on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, Threads, and Blue Sky. Whew, that's the last time I'll be saying that in a video for a long time. And if you've been watching our reaction video series, I would personally like to thank you very much for watching. And don't forget to follow us on our socials because, you know, Junior Eurovision is literally just a couple of weeks away, hopefully, by the time this video gets published. And... You know, don't forget to follow us for our coverage of this year's competition. And obviously, Eurovision 2025 season is in full swing with all the selections and, you know, internal selections that might happen soon. Who knows? So do keep up with us for that one. Thank you once again, and we'll see you guys 
on the next video. Bye.